Hi everyone, welcome back to our campaign video blog. Um, I'm so glad you could join us. We're counting down the days until election day. Um, voter registration deadline is next Monday, October 5th, so make sure you get registered to vote or update your voter address. Uh, in today's video blog, I wanted to quickly tell you about two articles in today's paper. The first one um, related to the role that millennials could and should play in this year's city election. Um, millennials clearly spoke out and said that they care about city connectivity, they care about green spaces, they care about having a city that has positive energy and is somewhere we can become the very best version of ourselves. Um, so if you're a millennial out there, I um, am grateful for your support and I challenge you to get involved um, in this year's city election and in making our city the very best that we can be. Uh, the second article that I want to talk about is um, was actually a column by John Webb and he talked about the uh, fatal crash on I-69 that claimed the lives of two and injured 22 others. The underlying issue under this story is just the level of struggle that families in our community go through to make ends meet. Um, I rarely mix uh, my campaign work with Big Brothers Big Sisters, but I feel compelled to tell you that you can make a difference. Um, we can start one individual by one individual, and that's what Big Brothers Big Sisters does. It takes one volunteer and one child and builds a meaningful relationship um, that can really impact their entire lives. And I promise it'll impact yours too. Um, since becoming a volunteer with Big Brothers Big Sisters about seven years ago, um, I have started uh, just to get a glimpse into the challenges that are faced by those families. Questions like, um, I don't have enough money to make ends meet this month. Am I going to pay the water bill, keep the lights on, keep the toilet running? Or am I going to go to the grocery store and buy food for my kids so they're not hungry? If you have three hours a month and are willing to make that one year commitment, will you visit the link below and sign up to be a big brother or big sister? We have over 100 kids waiting. Um, it'll change your life and it'll be a first step um, to really making a difference in our community. Um, we can all do better and we need everyone, individuals, volunteers, nonprofit agencies, and our, our local business community all working together in creative and collaborative ways um, to really move the needle on our city, on the challenges that are faced um, within our city and with every single family in it. Um, yesterday, we had a neighborhood outreach at Jacobsville Park, and um, while it may not be traditional campaigning, uh, it was one of the best things I've done since running for office. Um, just the joy on the kids' faces, and yes, some of them came back for three or four pieces of cotton candy, three or four bags of popcorn, um, but it was wonderful to see the families all out in the community, getting to know each other, um, and really uh, just just being a neighborhood, just being a community. And those are the types of things that we should expect from um, individuals serving in public office and um, what I would also ask each of you to get involved in. Thank you so much and um, the countdown is on until November 3rd. I really appreciate your support and hope you have a blessed day. Bye.